I have always loved the stars. Your death is too good to be true. You can't fool me. Deception was not my desire. You deserve truth. You cannot wield the force. Yet you triumph over powers far greater. You have earned my respect. I followed you here so we might speak undisturbed. You're not planning to propose, are you? Do not play the fool. The galaxy changes, and we must change with it. Your misfit crew. They aspire to your example, but are merely shadows. Your dutiful beast. The sentimental gunman. An apathetic monarch. The artless fraud, and a forsaken avenger. You have no use for them. I trust them to watch my back. Besides, they make me look good. Without you, they are nothing. Which is why I'm sure they're coming up with a plan to spring me. Each day they drift further out of reach, without a center to hold, without us, the galaxy, and all within it spiral into chaos. What's happening to me? The carbon freezing was imperfect. Your body is poisoned. Dying, old foes have come to take your life. I beat them before, I'll do it again. If you want to live, you must fight. You can escape their fate, if you dare to be more than a criminal. I know a con when I hear one. What's your game, old man? <laughs> you made your fortune in this corrupt republic, but money cannot save you now. You're slow on the uptake. I'll spell it out for you. Leave me alone. I offer help. You seek shelter you do not need. There is greatness in you that cannot be denied. You are a far superior leader to any chancellor. You applying to be my campaign manager? A new order must replace this one. Why not yours? This Republic is not worth saving any more than my Empire. We have a greater purpose. If you think we're joining forces, you're insane. Am I? You failed to defend their home. They will not forgive you. I'm not afraid of them. It's just a bad dream. But the carbonite poisoning is quite real. Republic. Empire. The Eternal Throne conquers all. You cannot stop it. Save yourself. You do not belong to the Republic any more than he did. You have always lived outside the law. You're right, but I don't belong to you either. When it comes to your future, your will is law, not mine. Zios, the world where everything changed. For me, you, the galaxy. You killed every living being here. They died, opening my eyes to the truth. 
I have passed beyond death's reach. Care to put that claim to the test? You will not be disappointed. Our flesh is not who we are. Voices, hands, children. I no longer require those crude vessels. At long last, I am truly free. Your freedom cost millions of innocent lives. You're nothing but a monster. I am a part of you. Now more than ever, I have done all I can to preserve your life. Why would you do that? You are a part of me I wish to keep. I cannot save you unless you want to live. I can take this heap of slag alone. Show me. You are the only one who has ever matched my will to survive. Stop comparing yourself to me. You cannot deny we share a common foe. It can't be. I've only been gone. Longer than you think. Zakul has surpassed my expectations. The most powerful fleet in history, and an army of guardians who know the forces more than light or dark. But my children... My children abuse their power. Never pegged you as a family, man. Maybe it was all the planet killing. Abandoning my past let me experience pleasures I denied myself before. I have no love on Zakul. Who knows? Even you may find it. I've had more than my share of lovers. Temporary comforts. I speak of something higher. We must deal with my errant son and daughter before they ruin everything. It's not completely their fault. Zakul is as corrupt as the Empire. But the Eternal Fleet makes it infinitely more dangerous. Do not underestimate their threat. It will take both of us to undo the damage they can inflict. Daughter's giving me the eye. Valen was always my favorite. What is it? Interesting. Your daughter doesn't trust your son. She trusts no one. I'm dying. We are being reborn. Wake up. We have to go. 